Hello and welcome to Explore Bio. To control the COVID-19 pandemic, detection of infected individuals is the first in the primary step. Several detection kits are already available in the market, among which the rapid antibody-based kits are the most commonly used. In today's video, we will learn what is an antibody-based kit, what is the principle behind its use and how it works. So let's start with what is the antibody based kit. The kit is also known as serological or immunological kit and it is the most economic and most popular choice for COVID-19 detection. The chip looks similar to that of pregnancy kits chip. It is based on the principle of detection of antibodies against COVID-19 virus in the patient's blood. Now coming on to how it works. The chip comprises of a sample well where the blood sample is loaded. This is followed by a conjugation pad which contains the COVID-19 antigen coated gold particles. Next are the three test areas containing human anti-IgM, anti-IgG and rabbit anti-IgG named as AIM line, G line and C line respectively. The blood or the serum sample is loaded in the sample well of the chip and diluent is added to help the lateral movement. When the sample reaches the conjugation pad, here it encounters COVID-19 antigen coated gold nanoparticles. If the sample has antibodies against COVID-19, it will bind and form conjugate of antigen coated gold and antibody. This conjugate moves towards the test line area. The first line is the M line that contains anti-IgM antibodies and binds to the conjugate IgM antibodies in the sample and produce a red color. The second line is the G line which contains anti-IgG antibodies that binds to conjugate IgG antibodies in the sample and produce a red color. The last line is a control line that has anti-IgG antibody of rabbit as a positive control of the test run. After the run is complete, wait for 15 to 20 minutes before interpreting the results. Now how to interpret the results? If only line appears in the control, it means the run is successful and the sample does not contain antibody against COVID-19, which means that the patient is not infected. If no line appears in the C, it means the test is unsuccessful and needs to be repeated. If M line appears, it means IgM antibodies are present, suggesting recent infection of COVID-19. As IgM antibodies are produced as a result of primary immune response. If G line appears, it means IgG antibodies are present, suggesting that the infection of COVID-19 is over a week old. As IgG antibodies are produced as a result of secondary immune response. So that's all for the today's video. See you in the next video.